<clears throat> what is up guys, it is Shucks over here with another Minecraft tutorial. Now, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you a, um, a prep tool for uh, Minecraft modding. And it'll um, fix any mod problems you have while installing. Uh, and using Skydis installer, so it'll get all old um, uh, config files away. And all mods, remove all mods, and remove the folders. Um, and it's a two-step uh, program and very basic. And I also show you another tool at the end of the video, which well, it's a little more basic, but it's by the same developer and it has uh, a total reset tool. Uh, but one notice you must know before to back up your texture packs like I have done, uh, because it will erase those texture packs. But if you don't care, fine. But first of all, uh, well, upon opening the program, you can get it from the link in the description. Upon opening, you will see two buttons. This one is uh, the clean button, and the scan micro folder, so this one's like, not, um, can I use it? And then, um, so, yeah, because it's just grayed out, kind of. But the first step, and it says step one and step two. So you can go over uh, to scan macro folders. Oh, and I have a lot of tutorials planned for you guys, so you just click that. So while it scans, I'll talk about some stuff. Um, the mud quality, uh, the terrible quality in, like, the parkour videos, um, like the parkour heroes, uh, was because of, I don't know why it's not, okay, there we go. Um, but because of the parkour hero videos, uh, it was bad because, um, Fraps has a very bad audio recording codec. Uh, because it is, I just don't like it. I mean, it always has a metal C sound in the back and everything. But when I record external with Audacity, uh, which is an upcoming video, it sounded great. And the expression encoder, which I'm using now, is also sounding pretty good. So I'm not going to try ranting too much, and I'm, but I'm going to just, just, uh, yeah, heads up. And then, um, yeah, and there's going to be more um, tutorials on the way. I have been working, and I'm uh, having my friend, a couple friends help me out on this one too, um, to find the, a simple um, multiplayer duplication glitch, because it's been highly requested, and no one has seemed to found a good one besides uh, for all items. But yeah, okay, so now you've seen it's done and it has all like the texture packs and everything. And then all the config files for my uh, damage indicators mod. I have this backed up too. And all the uh, like, all the all the config files for every mod I have have in my .minecraft folder. And the biomes are plenty, all the config files and castle defenders, all this stuff. You go ahead and click clean. And right there clean and now it is cleaning your uh, config folders so oh it's, oh when it this when it not responds just keep just let it do what it wants um, I kind of messed it up and then there you go just let it do all this um, this is for minecraft 1.4.2 when it was originally at it so uh, yeah but this is just getting rid of all the stuff and there you go it's all clean so if I were to like run a new scan oh oh you're gonna take a break okay yeah no no okay oh I mean, okay there go uh yeah see this was for 1.4 by 2 but it works for different things and um but i think since it is for 1.4.2 when you log into minecraft like you load up minecraft and uh, i think you may have to either go up here to force update or just log in here. I haven't tested it. Oh yeah, it'll update it uh, and get you a new jar. So it'll be good. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. It'll automatic cleaning tool. Uh, get rid of all your config files, all mods. Make sure every this will make every mod work. So when you install something with the Skynet install, it'll work. Install something regularly, it'll work. This will help for any p people having trouble with like mods I've tutorials I've done like the Flans mod and stuff like that. So uh, I thank you guys for watching. Hopefully the quality is good and you enjoyed it. I'm trying to make the tutorials more explained well and uh, editing them more creatively to make them more interesting uh, to watch. Uh, so yeah, hopefully uh, the output of this video is going to be good. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video, which hopefully will be posted uh, today, tomorrow. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so talk to you guys then. And hopefully we can get um, a new mic soon. So yeah, talk to you guys later.